Hello and welcome to the Media Hunt Show. My name is Andrew. Thanks for tuning in. Last time we left off, we defeated Team Magma at the Weller Institute. Although we haven't received the Pokemon as our prize, it doesn't really matter. I've healed up my Pokemon in the PC, except for Kung Fu, but it's fine. Uh, Peaches is next to be Trent. Yeah, excuse me. If anyone remembers uh, the Pokemon shorts in Pokemon Generations, we were at the bridge where Figaroff and Pikachu were fighting. And if we head down south, we come to water where we go and surf to the waterfall or down to the... Down to... No, oh, what's this? May. Um, I haven't been that far. Well, at six Pokemon. How are you doing? You being the professor's daughter, you must have a lot of Pokemon in the high levels, and I only three. Well, that's awkward. Meet my flying type peaches. Um, squish it. Mm. Can a mushroom defeat a giant flying park tree brachiosaurus type thing? Oh, we got poisoned. Of course, it's poison. Well, I guess it beats paralysis, kind of. Peaches is gonna win. Peaches, this is your first battle. You kind of have to win. Nice. Uh, about to use normal. Yeah, we're switching. To blue. Nice. Well, now we will serve you. And that's normal taken care of. Last but not least, Marsh Stomp. Jeez. Eh. Let's hope he just doesn't pass out. I kind of feel like I should pro. Yeah. I'm going to heal. Never mind, this is a one shot, so Razor Leaf. And it's taking me down. Uh, that's fine. I got over cocky there. Grind water type. Eh, I have a real water weakness. Um Dragon Breath. Huh, I would have used Water Gun if I were her. Rather than all these recoil moves. Nice. Paralyzed. Huh. And that's you decking care of. Nice. Uh, yep, I am. Really? Bitch, I have five badges, six poke well more than six now. Oh. Never mind, you're such a sweet person giving me fly. Um Huh. Well let's teach Peaches fly. Um Peaches, yep. Yep, which move should be forgotten? Uh, Sweet Scent. So I can stop fucking clicking it. And accidentally keep clicking Fly, I guess. Um, let's go heal. I'm just gonna put them all into the PC and then out again. Huh. Yeah, they're literally down there and there. That's cool. Move. Uh, deposit. Deposit. Anyone that's fought is going to get deposited. Deposit. Deposit. Withdraw. 
Withdraw. Withdraw. Withdraw. Bye bye. Here we go. Back up to full health. And Peaches, you can take over again. Maybe I should have called you Bananas. Or something interesting. Oh well. So as I said, down there leads to a patch of grass. I think there might be an item down there, but that's about it. Watch out for the ninja, another ninja, and we are for Tree City. Here we go. Let's heal up first. Yes, please. Yep. Thank you. No worries. See ya. And now, let's see. Ninjas tend to use poisons. Eh. Hmm. Yeah, sure. You're kind of like Konohamaru, or whatever his name is, from uh, Naruto. Your ninja abilities suck. Uh, fly. Oh, a double team? That might actually make it difficult. Uh. Oh, sword stance. That's a lot of stat boosts, but uh, that is, should be it. Yeah, fly is such a good attack. I am at defeat. Yes, you do. Well, if you have that, then this guy must have coughing. Oops, sorry guys. Hit the mic. Hey, let me see. Uh, coughing, yeah. Which are going to be a nightmare to fight. So let's be a dick and switch to Juggernaut. The only thing is... Juggernaut's grind based attacks don't work on them. But Metal Claw should be fine. Uh huh, you have to resort to tackling me. Juggernaut's trains his body to be as hard as steel, it's not gonna work. Eh, headbutt. Eh, another coughing. Nice try. There we go. Next. Hmm. Well, I guess that's a uh, fight over. Up we go. Let's see. I haven't been in Fortree City in a while. I know there's some sort of... Uh-huh. Hey there, it's Pokemon I'm looking for. Pikachu, do you have one? I'll trade it for a Skitty. Hell no. Pikachu's hard enough to come by. What's over here? People Pokemon. <coughs> Probably left. Nope. Two rights, make a left. And I get Hidden Power. Now, Hidden Power works by diff by working for the EV value, so each Pokemon's type of Hidden Power is different, but the game tends not to tell you. Oh yeah, Gabby. We're on TV. Something about this trainer that piqued our interest. We've battled Andy before, but we can attest that this trainer has the most definitely improved from before. I knew we were onto someone special when we spotted this trainer. The best way to determine how strong a trainer is, well, the fastest way is to battle, of course. And so we began our investigation. We ended up in a battle of Andy. In a dominating performance, we were flattened, rolled up, and tossed aside. He's ruthlessly strong, I guess that's a good way to be. And we asked the trainer for a... Uh, succinct? I don't know what that word means. Combination of iron. 
and Welmer was defined, selflessly supporting each other in the thick of battle. Headbutt. Uh, really? That's a bit much. Andrew's Pokemon, Andrew and Aaron, and I choose you. This deep, this deep, significant behind that quote. Yeah, there's nothing good on TV. Completely scripted. What's here? Yeah. So, part of me thinks that there is something here. Hello. How would you smell out of those mages? Ah, yes, these guys, you follow them about. They're going love messages. The Wingle girl way down so uh, south of here. But I can't be bothered chasing Wingles. I know there's other items here. This is such a strange town. Ah. Uh, for secret base, okay. Uh, secret base. Ain't wasting that type of money. He's cute. Be cool living in tree houses, but the amount of bugs and birds, snakes, depending on where you are. I always thought there was more to here. Oh, whatever. I can't go to Fortree City Gym just yet. I do believe there is a Cacleon in the way. Not that we really are meant to know that, but yeah, spoilers, Cacleon. Fight me. Um, I didn't ask that. I don't even care if you're carrying it or not. Let's see, what do you got? A uh, Goldeen. Well, Peaches can handle that. Razor Leaf. Oh, Horn Attack? Like Horn Attack, it's cool. Well, Razor Leaf actually is doing pretty good. The level difference doesn't seem to matter. And we dodged the Supersonic, that's good. Not from worse than being confused at this point. There, level 26. Eh, Welmer. Why do you carry water types would be my question more than... Eh, it doesn't matter. I can beat Welmer. Oh, or not. Oh, there's Whirlpool. And it's gonna do Fugul. And do the Whirlpool animation again, yep. Not really a great Whirlpool animation. Kinda preferred Sack and Jan's version. <sighs> yeah, I've been up to date. Mm. I know you can catch Absol here. Oh wow, these guys again. Jeez, I just watched the report not that long ago. Uh. Mm. Our team's definitely improved. Yeah, I remember you. I was watching this on TV earlier. Oh, you want to interview right away? Not even a question this time. Okay, what's your move? Oh, you've evolved. Yeah. Why did I think this was a good idea? Oh, Thunder Wave. Geez, you're really fast. I wonder if I'll win this time. You're just not that effective here. Kung Fu, come in. Oh, shit. Surf's actually quite good. Oh, supersonic. So you're going for the power fusion? Mm, whatever. 
Yeah, there's power fusion set in. Maybe these are better than I gave you credit for. Maybe Wilmer's just gonna win this whole battle. Well, just that ah, crap is hair. No, I, I, there we go. I wonder if this will drown it though. Yep. Hmm, that battle did not go over as well as I thought it might. Whirlwind. Nah. Oh, there we go, level 34. It was an okay battle. Yeah, I do. Sure. Uh, we'll go with Pokemon. Sure. Yeah, perfect clincher. I get the real feel of a good TV show. We'll air this on TV. Yeah. So these guys, Gabby and Ty, they rotate around three different areas. The first area being outside Mobville City, towards the north. Um, the second place being to the east of Mauville City and finally being here to the east of Fortree City and they rotate constantly getting stronger they will continuously get stronger until I re believe they reach their level cap after a wee bit but they are easy experience if you want to follow them around they'll keep battling you let's see I'm going to switch into Kung Fu um, so we're almost all fully evolved. 2, plus 10, plus 10 more levels. Damn. So about 25 more levels altogether for everyone to be fully evolved. Well, everyone needs to gain 10 levels then. would be the easiest way to say it. See, they're gone. Oh look, another bird person. Um, uh, we're quite strong. Would you like me to prove it? Oh, it's wobbly. I was going to train it for the dragon type, but when I caught, um, trap hinge, it kind of changed everything. Oh, a safeguard. So status conditions mightn't even work. None missed. So you prevent any stat changes on yourself from being effective. Well, whatever. That was a waste of two turns for you. Yeah. So yeah, we get a chance to catch Cacleon, and they're kind of difficult to catch outside of this. As you can see the shadows there. Hey, Steven. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Now you can use Cacleon. I'm not a fan of Cacleon, but whatever. Let's see. So you, I. So the way Cacleon works is when you attack it, its color change ability activates. And it becomes the type of the last move to hit it. It's kind of like the early version of Protein. Oh shit, a side beam. That's gonna hurt. Right, enough bulking up. Let's double kick its face in. It should become a fighting type. Yep, there's color change. But it doesn't matter. Now you can catch it here. Um, a wee bit further back there. Or outside the... Well, actually, no. I think that's the only two spots. No, oh, Devon Scope. There's one over there at that staircase, and there's one outside the gym, but I don't think you fight the one at the gym. Whoa, 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 where'd he go? Yeah, whatever. Here. Yep, we are gonna knock it out. Hello, Cacleon. You can catch them in the grass now. I know they're a bit harder to run into, but they do appear. So it's not like you're actually giving up the chance to catch them. I might need quick attack now. Vant attack. Hmm. 
but they don't do much, so... To be honest, they can learn most attacks, but with the type change, you'd lose the stat bonus. And you'd be better off attacking it yourself, but then... Mm, I'm just not a great Cacleon user. I understand its abilities, and... Protein is the better version of itself, but... Still... Let's scare off this one. Yeah, this one doesn't fight. Just in case you're saving up your Pokemon. Now this is a flying type gem, so uh, Combuskin is going to have a difficult time in there. So I think I'm going to use this time to go off and train. And I will catch up with you in the next video. Thanks for tuning in. My name's Andrew. Next time we take on Fortree City, this is the Media Hound Show. And let's continue Pokemon Ruby next time.